Yo, what's going on, everybody? It's Snods here. Happy opening day for MLB The Show 22. Today, I want to show you guys how to snipe and how you guys can make a lot of stubs, especially right now at the beginning of the year. Everyone's trying to get those collections done fast. We're going to be smart here, and we're going to try to capitalize on everybody trying to be greedy. Now, in this video, I want to try to touch on pretty much everyone that's new to flipping. I'm kind of new to it as well, and I'm really seeing how many stubs you can make off of this and it's actually crazy now keep in mind this is not a quick snap and you know 10 minutes from now you'll have a hundred thousand stubs no it's not gonna work that way it is a grind it's it's another side grind out there and it's something that you can do also off to the side while you're doing moments and showdowns whatever it may be to be honest when you flip cards you're probably gonna make you know two three hundred four hundred stubs profit each time but if you keep repeating that and doing it over and over and using this method that I'm gonna show you it really adds up and as you can tell I can already I already have two, 22,000 stubs and I started this I think at like two three thousand so I mean it's a good way to start so first step what we're gonna want to do is scroll through the marketplace and keep an eye out uh, see if there's any big gaps out there I normally don't flip gold or not golds diamonds I flip gold so we're gonna set a filter here minimum overall of 80 and then a max overall of 84 so that'll bring up every gold player that's in the game now once you've done that you want to scroll through all your gold players here and just kind of get used to your prices here you'll the more you do this the more you'll get used to what things go for uh, as you can see here, we've got a Tyler Glass now that's up. That's got a decent gap to it. His buy now price is twenty six forty, and his sell now is at twenty one twenty eight. So looking at these numbers, if we were to uh, buy this at the twenty one twenty eight and sell it for twenty six forty, our profit would be at two forty eight. And let me show you how I came up with that. So. As you can see on your right hand side there, the sell now price is at twenty one twenty eight. We're gonna put a buy order in and we're gonna put a buy order in for one stub higher than that 2128 that you see on the right hand side so now our buy order is in first place so somebody can quick sell it to us for that amount so once somebody does that now we can go over and go to the sell tab here and sell it for 2637 which is on our left hand side there and then we'll get our profit there so I'm actually gonna buy a few of those uh, it went up a little bit I want to try to stay on top so we're at 2131 is what we're gonna buy it for we're still gonna be profiting this is this is what I'll do with something if I notice that there's a gap in a player and I notice that the player is moving a lot it's it's being sold a lot so I'll usually do about five at a time there and Usually once one sells, the rest of them sell shortly after that. I'm not sure why, but that's just how it works. Now, you guys want to always remember that there is a 10% tax on this buy now price. So the way you can figure that out is just doing the 10% uh, of the 26.40 that's there, or 26.43. Uh, if you suck at math like me, all you have to do is subtract uh, 264 just take the first three numbers in that number and subtract it from the actual number so you'll do 264 minus 2643 and you'll come up with your 10% all right so I'm gonna sit back we've got five orders in for Tyler glass now and it's see what I mean like right here it's it's about 200 profit for each one of these if you buy them in a bunch like this it really adds up so we're looking close to about a thousand profit if we get all these and sell them for what we saw. So this is what I mean. You know, it's it's little small chunks that add up. So I found another one here for Pete Alonzo. This is actually a really good one. His buy now is at forty nine forty and his sell now is at four thousand sixty six. So if you're trying to figure out what the gap would be, you do four hundred and ninety four minus 4,940 and that's how you figure out what your 10% is. So it changed a little bit when I went in but it's not big of a difference. We're going to do a 
buy order for 4070 and we're gonna put a few of those in because this is pretty big profit right here if I hit on a couple of these we'll be sitting nice so let's wait a minute let's see if those actually sell to us if they do we're gonna make out pretty well let's see perfect okay so our buy order went through for 4070 and now we are able to go in and sell this bad boy so we're gonna go into the sell tab here and then you're gonna wanna Ooh, that's a pretty good big gap we're actually gonna go into create sell order here and I'm gonna sell it for 4700 there's a big gap there between the 4500 and the 4899 uh, look at that another sell or buy order went through see what I mean they just come in chunks I'm not sure why so if I were to sell it for 4700 we would get 4230 back. So if you do 4230 uh, minus 4070, that comes out to 160 profit. I think I could have done better though. The other one, I'm gonna put it up for this 4952, which is one less than the one at 4953. And that's probably gonna sell. Because 4700, it's, it's a big gap. That one's gonna sell pretty quick and then the 4952 will be at the top right after that so that's a pretty good profit I think it's just a few hundred uh, profit right there but like I said if you look at that look how quick that sold 4230 that was the one for 4700 so that was our profit there that was you know probably like 160 or something like that and then we got the one at 4952 which is gonna sell for more and that'll be more profit which will be a couple hundred but See how see how quick everything's moving right now? We just got another Pete Alonzo for 4070 that we can sell. You know, these things come in chunks. And if you're seeing that a card is moving fast like this Pete Alonzo, stay with this card. Don't move. Look at that. That one for 4950 or whatever just sold for 4408. So let's see. Yeah, that was that was pretty good profit there. Yeah, stick with the same card if you're seeing a card that's moving a lot and just keep it going see look another one just sold this is a method that is crucial at the beginning of the year because everyone's trying to get those collections done as soon as they can so people will do anything to you know they'll just hit buy now and it's they're just paying way more than what they should so this is my uh, active orders that I have and you can see like look at the players I do this in chunks when I see there there's a player that's very active in the market that's the one that I'm gonna stick with and I'm gonna keep going until things slow down so this Pete Alonzo I'm gonna capitalize on this bad boy as much as I can now if you guys are like me and you can't sit here and you're you don't want to flip cards all day long you want to actually grind the game and do your moments and get all that stuff done you can get that done and you can do that with the MLB The Show 22 companion app. This is huge. You can flip the market and play the game at the same time. So this is available on iPhone and Android. You wanna go in the app store and search MLB The Show 22 companion app. Once you get that downloaded, connect your account to the app and you'll be able to access your inventory and you'll be able to flip things in the market on your phone while you're playing the game. So I'll show you that real quick. So we're here on my phone, sorry if it's a little bit blurry, but this is the app, MLB The Show 22 companion app, and this is how you work, work it. If you hit the button on the right hand side there, you can look into your inventory, you can go into your current orders, we're looking at all the things that we have. Uh, we've got a couple buy orders for Rossiel Iglesias, and on the, see, there we go. Buy order just went through for Rossiel Iglesias. The cool thing about this is you can set notifications on this as well. So when a buy order goes through, you'll be able to get that notification. It'll go right to you. And uh, you can also sell it on here as well. So how I sell things is I go into my inventory here. And then there's Rossiel Iglesias. And it'll show you all the prices that you have uh, currently going right now on the market right now. So the buy price for Rossiel Iglesias was 36 something and see look we can throw it up on the market right now and then you'll hit finalize order on the right hand side do not hit that sell now button at the bottom I've made that mistake a lot hit finalize order on the right hand side and it puts it up on the market so look at that it already sold so this app is really cool 
and it's something really cool to do on the side while you're grinding the game on your Xbox and you can be making stubs on your phone at the same time as well. This is a list of all the completed orders. What I like to do is go into that completed orders and just continue refreshing to see you know, what activity is happening, what's, what's being sold, what's being bought, and you can always keep an eye on it in there. So that's the companion app. Go ahead and download it. It's very useful. So yeah, guys, those are the basics of playing the market and flipping cards. Uh, reminder, this is the best time to do it right now because people are trying to rush and get those collections done. Uh, this probably won't work all year long because these, these gaps close up a little bit. But it's definitely good to keep an eye out and see what is going and what you can capitalize on and maximize all your stubs. So I definitely recommend doing this right now. This is probably going to be good for a couple months because people are still going to be buying the game even after launch and trying to get these collections done as soon as they can. I hope I explained things as clear as I could. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below and I will respond and help you guys out. I hope this method makes you guys plenty of stubs. Let's keep grinding. This is day one. This is a very fun game. I'm having a lot of fun playing it. Please be sure to subscribe if you guys enjoy the channel and leave a like guys. I would much appreciate it. We're on the grind. Having a lot of fun. I'm out of here guys. Peace.